Hi guys, welcome to GIS Explorer YouTube channel. It is best integrated GIS channel. I am Orun, GIS expert. If you first time in our channel, then subscribe our channel and press the bell icon to get our latest uploaded information about GIS. Today I'll discuss you how to create and edit point features in QGIS. Before starting this video, I would like to tell you more about the point. Point is a feature which is defined by a pair of x y coordinate. It has neither length nor area. So guys, what we'll do now? At first open the QGI software. Go to layer menu. Create layers. Then new save file layer. Then uh, give the file name in your suitable location. File coding should be UTF-8. Geometry type should be point and projection should be WGS 84 UTM zone 45 N then OK and at attribute table has to be create here so you can either create this column in the beginning or we can add them after so don't be afraid of you have missed something we add something called name text type should be data type should be text length you can change the length and add to field list that's where you can create others field after input your data just hit on OK button. Now I add a base layer. Now we can zoom in for our interstate area. First of all, we add a point features. Just click on point layer and click on the toggle editing and then click on add point features. Just click on left mouse button on your desired location and put the name a id 1 and then ok if you would to like others point zoom in your position and just click on your digital location then input ID and name
same way you can add others point features in this layer after getting all the points you have to click on this save player edit button tool now your point layer is saved on your location if you change the symbology of the point features then right click on the point and properties select a point and then ok and uh, what we'll do now I'll show you how to edit the point features this is vertex tool it is used for edit vertex of any features so just click on this vertex tool and click on point features and click another position just see here if you show its table of vertex then right click on the editable features to show the table of vertex just right click on the point and see here so just I replace it if you undo of the features then you click on undo tool and you can also use redo tool if you modify of the attribute of any features then you have to click select features and select any features and just click on this tool modify the attribute all selected features tool you can change the name here from here you can delete of the features using this delete select delete button delete tool and you have to also cut copy paste from here I just duplicate layer create a duplicate layer and remove all attribute just select this one and cut paste features see here you can move any to for features using this tool you can add any features you can add part of the point features so 
you have to select first any point features and then click on add part and just click your desired location this point are attached with main point attribute you can delete part of using this tool delete part tool you can also merge two features two point features using this tool merge selected features here is most important another tool enable advanced digitizing tool just I select any point and click on vertex tool and then click on enable advanced digitizing tool If you change any location of the point depends on distance, angle and latitude, longitude then just click on this point and change the direction, change the place as your requirement. See here. distance D for distance A for angle and X for longitude and Y for latitude so so see here distance of the existing point 100 approximate 100 and angle 220 degree and latitude here 643827 and longitude sorry latitude 2499062 and longitude 643827 if you want to replace the point then click here so guys that's of all for today I hope that you get mileage on this video so please make sure you like and subscribe my channel and share the video on social media Thank you for watching.